back in uh, back in action here in Salt Lake. Um, I think maybe we should all be up at Park City right now snowboarding, but it's all good. I'm happy to be here close to home. So hopefully it's pretty nice right now. It snowed a lot last night, so hopefully hopefully it holds it together. And yeah. Have a good night. What about the track? Just took a look at it. How's it look? Yeah, it looks good. I mean, it's definitely a, a little bit. Uh, it's maybe going to be a little bit wet, but I don't know. We'll see on track walk. It don't look too bad. It could be worse. Yeah. So are you feeling 100% today? Or? Yeah. I mean, I'm close for sure. I mean, I would like to have a little more time, but there is no more time. So we're here. We're going to make it happen. Yeah, in Bulgaria, and once I got second twice. Oh, okay, sweet. And then, uh, so now you're back here for Salt Lake City. What are you? What have you been doing in Germany? Have you been prepping for Supercross here? Exactly. Yeah, I've been watching all the races, and uh, um, it has been fun because uh, I went out with my friends a lot, and um, actually uh, then went to Bulgaria at a GP there, and uh, then straight to Holland. So it has been good. Are you moving over here to America? This I have year? no idea actually. I don't know what I should do. Um, when I'm in Europe, I want to stay there. When I'm here, I want to stay here. The German girls are better there. That's nah, the truth. Uh -uh. Yeah, they're better there. Okay. Swedish have you been girls? There? Are Swedish girls better? Um, close. Do the girls, are, is, is the girls I actually like Swedish for the girls. Really? The blondes. <laughs> <laughs> she's Swedish. Yeah, she's Swedish. Swedish. How are you feeling? Mm, I feel okay. I'm sick, so I don't know. No, Who I. Who got you sick? Huh? Who got you sick? I have no idea. Since Monday, since the GP, it's bad, and I just, I don't know. I don't take anything because just fruits. What about the track? You take a look at it yet? I had no, not yet. Track walkers have one, oh, so okay. we'll see. Hopefully, not too bad. Should be good. It's a little chilly here in Salt Lake. We got some snow this morning. We're looking forward to tonight. It's supposed to be pretty uh, clear tonight, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So what's the uh, game plan for tonight? Uh, just get good starts. Make it easy on myself and be consistent. I've been consistently on the podium every race, so I'd like to get another win. So I'd be happy with the win tonight if uh, if I can do that. Just gonna put myself in a good position and try to try to win tonight. I'm just sitting here in SLC strictly Dia. How you doing, man? Um, just been here in Spartacus Beats all day. It's getting fired up. It's a little cold. What about what do you got today? You got Number one today? in my vision. Huh? Yeah. There's no other way. I don't know. I'm feeling pretty good. This looks sick. Mountains are sick. Looking for Vito. Where's Vito? Is he gonna hit the triples of snowboard today? <laughs> Hottest brunettes ever. They're killing monster girls. <laughs> <laughs> That's just you the way it is. <laughs> what are you guys rooting for tonight? Fill the photo. Fill the photo. Fill the photo. Right? Just because the bike is the back in the back of your Falcon truck? No. He's on our team. Our teammate. Like red hair. Yeah. <laughs> they like boys with red hair. Did you hear that? Oh, not much. We're uh, chilling out here in the snow. Yeah. It's pretty awesome, I think. So, uh, let's go ahead and check out the track. Um, actually, we haven't seen it yet. We got this delayed schedule, but uh, now we're gonna go check it out here in a couple minutes, and uh, it should be good. You feeling good? Feeling confident? Yeah, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident. I had a bad weekend last weekend, and uh, I'm really looking to rebound from it. So, should be safe. Uh, how are you in uh, these kind of conditions? Um, I honestly don't know. I don't think I've ever ridden in the snow before. Maybe once or twice in Colorado at Tomac's house, but uh, I think it'll be fun. It's something new. It's always exciting, so we'll see how it goes. We're in Salt Lake. Yeah. We're giving a shout out to Transworld. Right. <laughs> Here in Salt Lake, freezing actually. The track was actually really good when I uh, when I did track walk. The guys did an awesome job covering it, and uh, of course in between the jumps there was a little bit of water, but we just went out for pr first practice, and the track is. It's actually pretty technical. The whoops are very challenging today, and um, I think it's gonna be a great night. We got a 
for us, our first right-hander, um, first turn, so it'll be good. What a gay horse to be. <laughs> Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. All right, hey, everybody, wonder what's going on over here. This is Hart and Huntington, okay? Hart and Huntington, we care about you guys. Come out to snow, be the element, whatever. We want all you guys, whoever wants to, come over here and get a hot dog. Because what we do, our name of our team is Hart and Huntington, but this weekend it's going to be called Hart and Hot Dogs for you guys. So come get a hot dog and enjoy yourself. If you guys want to like hang out and sit under the tent, you're more than welcome. No other team in this paddock can say come on in because I don't know why, but this is what we do. We're here for you, we got all you guys, we would have a job. So please come support us, we support you, have hot dogs, have a bottle of water, and enjoy your day. Cool, yeah. Trans world, oh trans world, trans world. When are you gonna call me? I need to like do some wakeboarding for your magazine and stuff like that, alright? Hit me up. No. I'm in if she's in. <laughs> yeah, you can find me called Rockstar in LA. My name is Laura. I'll be in LA. <laughs> you can find me there. <laughs> she got done with practice. First practice in Salt Lake. Hanging out, looking at times, second at times. Just chilling. Yeah. Good. It's uh, a lot colder here and uh, it snowed last night, but it was good. The track turned out actually really good. It's almost dry compared to what I thought it was going to be. But make for some good racing. I'm just trying to get us some good practice times. Uh, got first gate pick last week, so that was really easy on me. Couldn't start, so hopefully we can do a repeat tonight. Nice. Man, it has been an epic, epic season when you look at all the highs, the lows, the ups, the downs, the chases, the races that we've had, and you right now are in that points lead, and man, that's gotta take a little relief off you. Yeah, with two races to go, you know, we'll just try to get through tonight with, uh, you know, a good, strong finish, and. Uh, yeah, but I definitely want to get a, another win before the season's end here and uh, you know, just finish the season strong. You know, so many people doing the scenarios. Well, if, if Ryan goes 1-1, he's got this thing wrapped up. If he goes 1-2, 1-3, obviously you're out there for the win. The team is out there for the win, not only at a week-to-week -week basis, but that championship. Out of the top four guys, you're the only man who doesn't have that uh, championship under his belt, and that would be a sweet one. Yeah, no, for sure. It'd be awesome to, to wrap it up in Vegas and finally get my first uh, 450 Supergrass championship. But, uh, you know, we've been doing a lot of work, so, uh, you know, it's definitely going to pay off. And I think, uh, you know, we have the best shot at winning. We're six points up. So just get through tonight with, a, like I said, a good, strong finish. And, uh, you know, hopefully a win.